Hi there! Welcome to this video about Report Portal. The agenda is, first of all, to provide you some basic information about what Report Portal is and what are its main goals, and then I will mention some benefits of Report Portal so you can find out in what way it could be useful exactly for your teams and projects. I will also share some useful links in the end of this video. So, without further ado, let's get started. Report Portal is an artificial intelligence-powered application. Basically, it is a test automation dashboard that uses machine learning to speed up the analysis of failed, flaky tests, and it helps you to prepare a profound and understandable report with the help of such features as dashboards, filters, widgets, and so on. Our business goals are to increase the maturity of test automation processes, its visibility, and improve the process of continuous testing practice. If we take the CI-CD pipeline, which is considered to be one of the best practices to deliver code changes frequently and reliably, it is no doubt that testing plays a critical role in it. But it often turns out so the testing stage hides a lot of pitfalls that can incur great expenses. Among such pitfalls could be unstable scripts, missing visibility, manual regression takes too much time, or test automation feedback is ignored. And this is where Report Portal can help you. So let's move on to the benefits. The first benefit I would like to mention is that Report Portal helps you to receive analytics in real time. If you have a lot of tests or your tests are running 24 hours every day, you will really appreciate this function. Tests are reflected in Report Portal in real time, so you can start your investigations of the failure reasons immediately after a test is completed. You don't have to wait until the whole suite of tests is finished. Aggregation of all information about the autotests on your project in one place. With Report Portal, you have an access to executions of all autotest results and find info about any test item easily, as all test history, logs, attachments, and so on are stored in one place, so it helps you to achieve full automation visibility and find a failure cause in previous runs easily. Make automation results analysis actionable and collaborative meaning that you can classify test failures and quickly observe statistics around all tests as a whole. You can define a failure reasons of a test and set a defect type for it – product bug, automation bug, system issue or custom type – so you can visualize a structure of the failures. And the next benefit is a great addition to the previous one – establish fast traceability with defect management. In Report Portal, it is possible to set up integrations with bug tracking systems, where you can submit and track defects with full evidence, all logs, screenshots, comments, and etc., directly from a failed test case into a bug tracking system. I would also like to mention the visualization of metrics and analytics as one of the Report Portal's strong points. As you can create your custom dashboards with metrics to learn from the past and predict trends, we also provide a variety of widget types for creating a report about the product current status, effectiveness of automation, and readiness for the release. The next benefit is the delegation of a part of analytical work to artificial intelligence. So you can reduce the time cost and analyze the failure reasons by auto-analyzer based on machine learning. And finally, a great benefit is that the report portal is an open source tool. We also do provide paid support and we have a paid premium feature, but all mentioned benefits are available for free. And here are some useful links. A link to our main website, link to the official documentation, and the demo instance where you can try using Report Portal with demo data. Now you can follow the link to the demo instance and start your journey with Report Portal.